I don't have my teacher saying, hey, uh, get ready for this next week or just let you know this is coming up. Like you have to be on top of it yourself. So we started, I mean, we've always had a group chat and that's been going off more than usual. <laughs> uh, we tried to do group FaceTime. Um, that didn't really work. Um, just with connection and stuff, I found we both, all the whole group, we all found that um, Zoom worked better. So now we do Friday nights at around eight o'clock every week we Zoom. We haven't done a game night yet though. I think that would be fun. Um, it's just time set aside to make sure that you're making those interactions, like those social connections. So I'm actually working full time, which is really hard. <laughs> um, I'm doing the grad program through UF, the master's year in education. Um, my eventual goal after that is to go to law school because I want to do um, education legislation um, for students with disabilities on like write laws and fix all the bad stuff that's currently happening in our system. So I'm interning full time at a law office right now. It helps me a lot to wake up at 8.30, be there at nine, come home at five and do class for two hours. That's my schedule every day. And I think the biggest thing, even if I wasn't working, because there was a week when I came home before I started where I did the same thing. I wake up at nine and I treat it like a regular day. I actually, I'll show you, I guess I'm holding it here anyway. I live by my planner. I live by my book. And um, my friends actually make fun of me for it. And if it's not like, if it's not in that book, it's not actually happening. So I have to, I color coordinate everything. Um, especially for classes and stuff and that's been helping me too like I need to see what's coming up next week because I don't have in those two classes that have the zoom calls or that don't have zoom calls I don't have my teacher saying hey uh, get ready for this next week or just let you know this is coming up like you have to be on top of it yourself I have I can show them to you but they're all asleep I have three dogs that are literally right there so we walk every day, three times a day, all around. I have like a little cul-de-sac here, it's about a mile. So I walk her and then the other two can't go quite as far. So that's about what, like maybe five miles a day. Um, and I have a pool at my house, luckily. I know a lot of people don't have that luxury, but that's how I've been exercising because I was a swimmer in high school. So the downtime, whenever I get it, has been great for that. <laughs> My best piece of advice for everyone going through this is that tomorrow's going to come, we're going to be here together, and that's the biggest thing that you can do while also taking care of yourself.